an eclectic art exhibit taking over in Edmonton. To start at one end, make a giant circle and come back here, or you can do the opposite direction uh, and make a whole day of it. This small area packed with local artists is just a fraction of the vibrant exhibit that's taken over several blocks along White Avenue. It's nearly impossible to be in the area without encountering the dazzling display. The White Avenue Art Walk is back for its 28th year, stretching from 107th Street down to 103rd along White Avenue. Also set up in Wilbert McIntyre Park and in front of the Old Strathcona Farmers Market, with 400 artists showcasing their creations over three days. Every piece of art needs an audience that is part of the relationship of it. So this is exactly what we're doing. Oh, I wish I'd While some have been here every year for many years, this event marks the grand debut for others. I was inspired by my mother, who is an artist as well. Uh, she actually used to do the art walk when I was a little kid. So it been, uh, it's kind of a family thing. I came last year actually as like a, just a customer looking around and I thought it'd just be a really fun way just to get my name out there and meet other artists. Wesley McConnell is a born and raised Edmontonian who's been creating art for three years, specializing in acrylic and abstract work. Along with showcasing his work, he's taking the opportunity to connect with other local artists, discuss tricks of the trade, and form relationships with others in the community. As he reflects on his first day with his own display, the impact of this event in the community is top of mind. It gets people out of their homes and reintroduces them to what Edmonton is known for. It's like arts and uh, artistic mind frames and the ability to be creative. Some artists say they've experienced an emergence here, like this McEwen student with a knack for stained glass. She says this event demonstrates the powerful impact art has in the city, adding it's helped her meet some of her closest friends and embrace her creativity despite her introverted personality. This has actually really helped me like come out of my shell and like start talking to people and just like getting to know people and different experiences, different stories. The art walk runs throughout the weekend until Sunday from 10 a.m. to 5. In Edmonton, Elliot Knopp, City News.